Hi, my name is Dennis. Uh, uh, did a uh, YouTube video on these solar panels. Uh, at the time, I didn't have my uh, microinverters on my 12 panels. Well, I got them hooked up now, and I wanted to show them to you. Uh, again, that was my 8-panel pole. Uh, these are 230-watt panels. They uh, they run off batteries, so uh, uh, that's got uh, an inverter. Uh, but I unhooked this uh, for now because I wanted to see exactly what these 12 panels were doing. So I want to show you my uh, microinverters in the back. Uh, these uh, produce DC power at the panel, but then they go into what you call a microinverter, which is right back here. Uh, these microinverters, there's one on each panel. Uh, they put out 240 volts, um, uh, do real well. Um, this, again, this is 12 panels, they're 230 watt, 5 watt panels. Uh, the pole is 6 inches, um, very heavy pole. It's got a 30 inch uh, uh, stroke on the actuator that moves the solar panels to east to west. At night time they move them back east to uh, uh, wait for the sun in the morning. But uh, also you got these four bolts up here. You adjust the angle of the solar panels. Um, more or less you only adjust them like in the summertime you move it and then in the winter time you adjust it again because uh, the sun's a little lower. So uh, it's the only time you ever have to adjust that. Uh, anyways, very good uh, uh, pole, good solar panels, good action, uh, uh, microinverters, you get the cord with it. Um, all of this uh, is around, I'd say around $8,700. Um, anyways, does a very good job. I want to show you my meter uh, so you can see what that's doing. Um, so far, as a matter of fact, since I put this on eBay, I think I've sold at these uh, solar poles with the panels and the solar time tracker. Like I said, I did do a video on the solar time tracker, explains how it works, uh, how it operates. Uh, if you haven't seen that yet, I suggest maybe you should look at it and uh, that way you can see how easy it is to operate. Normally, this my meter runs back about every 12 seconds. I'll see what it's doing today. Uh, look for that black line there, that's how I kind of count. About how fast it's going back. So there's the black line. So as soon as it hits, okay, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. About eighteen seconds today. That's getting kind of late, but uh, that's pretty good. Uh, so this took, had took this one here, just that 12 panels, took my electric bill down to $15, and uh, that was only uh, two weeks into a month, so uh, that's pretty good, uh, take me back that much. So I want to show you my electric bill, that way you can see for yourself uh, what my electric bill's been doing. That's one thing when you do watch the YouTube videos, you want to, you got to kind of have proof and evidence that what exactly it's doing, so... That's kind of what I want to do, is going to show you what exactly what's going on with my solar. Yeah, we'll go in here. Turn some lights on. Okay, uh, this is the year 2013. This is what I did before they had any kind of solar uh, power, or uh, anyways. I was running 23,815 kilowatt hours per year with this. Just absolutely awful. So I had to do something. So um, I went with the solar. Um, this is my solar, my eight panel. I had to have the eight panels on. And it took me down to 11,575 kilowatts per hour uh, per year. Uh, so it really cut me down uh, better than half. So that, Good is great to see that, and like I said, and, uh, then I hooked this 12 panel up. Now it took me down to 48 kilowatts, so that made my bill down to 15 dollars and two cents. So that was really great, nice to see that uh, I can live with that. Um, this is again, that's the solar time tracker uh, that comes with it. Um, 
So anyways, if anyone is interested in the solar panels um, and the pole and the solar time tracker, like I said, it was 235 watt panels uh, and the microinverters, uh, around $8,700, something like that. So if anybody's interested, uh, email me at uh, solartimetracker at yahoo.com and uh, be more than glad to see what I can do to help you out. So, thank you. Uh, there is one more thing I did want to make sure I didn't forget to mention. I do have a geotherm furnace, uh, so it's electric heat and central air in my house. So that's one of the reasons why my bill is up where, you know, that's why I use so much power. Um, but uh, hopefully I can pretty much heat my house uh, with these solar panels in the wintertime because they do produce more power as colder they are, but uh, your days are shorter. But, but uh, also uh, you get that... Uh, that 30% uh, tax credit too. That's one thing you want to get done, uh, do before I believe sometime in 2016 and it's over with. So uh, now there is a good time to be uh, start thinking about solar. So, anyways, just thought I better throw that in there. So, um, anyways, I want to thank you guys for watching this video.